Wells won two Tony Awards, garnered seven nominations, and has earned widespread acclaim. Yeah, beautiful. The Carol King musical tells the story of the early life of the legendary singer-songwriter and her journey to fame. ABC's Genevieve Shaw Brown gives us a look behind the scenes. It's the Broadway musical you haven't seen and yet somehow know the words to every single song. Beautiful, the Carol King musical is the story of a season in King's life and it's a very different King than we know from Tapestry. How did she become Carol King? And, and she, she got married very young and she had children very young and she had this, she really strove a lot of her life to sort of have a many of us would conceive to be a very conventional lifestyle and I always thought of her as like this hippie with flowing hair and she was but it was like a journey to that. The journey was one of a shy songwriter who along with the husband she would eventually divorce and two dear friends made along the way penned some of the greatest hits of all time. This love I can We all know all the songs individually, but certainly don't know them all as part of these two particular writing partners' songbooks. And as these connections are made with, oh my God, these guys wrote that too, and that, and that, and that. And when she sang, and it's, you know, that you hear people, especially if they grew up with the music, making these wonderful discoveries that they didn't realize that these, these four Jews in a room wrote, you know, wrote all of these songs. Songs that you can't help but sing along to. Scott Campbell, who plays King's husband Jerry, is relatively new to the cast. You guys have never seen the show, but being uh, an outside perspective, the locomotion like kills it. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Jesse Mueller won the Tony for lead actress in a musical, but playing such an icon is a real challenge. It's a great bar to have every night to go out there and know you're playing a real person and a person that deserves to be honored in an appropriate way and, you know, with a lot of integrity. The exciting thing for the audience is to learn more about them as people because it informs the music. We had her album and played it over and over and over and over. I grew up listening to Carol King, her Tapestry album. I listened to every single song. <laughs> when he leaves me, whoa, whoa, I always tell people not to read the program song list because it's so much better if you're surprised because you think you know everything Carole King wrote and you don't and you think you don't know who Barry and Cynthia are and you do. They've, t they've formed your life. They form the soundtrack of your life. Genevieve Shaw Brown, ABC News, New York. I love those kinds of shows where you see real life and someone's history that you don't really know. And then to, you know, I love the shows where you go and you can sing along to every song. Would you sing along? Oh, of course, because nobody can really hear you over everybody else. No fear. <laughs> no fear of singing.